Let's do it. Let's do this, umbrellas. This is going to take a long time. Violence. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What the f- what, the, what am I watching here? I thought this was an innocent kids animation. There was a glowing city protected by golden gates known as heaven. Heaven? Oh, I've heard of it. Lucifer was one of these angels. He Lucifer. was a dreamer. We're getting some devil lore here. To expand the universe in their ways, they created Adam and Lilith. I, I, Adam and uh, who? Who's this imposter? This gift came with a curse. Evil finally found its way into Earth. Ah, so that's why Earth is fucked. Heaven cast Lucifer and his love into the dark pit he had created. Lilith thrived. <laughs> Lilith was like dark power evil. That's my kind of jam. <laughs> Every year, they would send down an army, an extermination, ensure hell and its sinners could never arrive. I would say that's messed up, but good. Did you hear all that? Uh, yeah, I was right there. Sorry. This animation looks so sick. Hear from your mom yet? Not that long. Only seven years. Ah, oh, seven years? Ah, oh, that's not bad. You only got abandoned for seven, not seven thousand. Well, hello there, you wayward sinner. Do you like blood violence? Yes. It's a place to stay that had none of that. That sucks. Has been hotel. So the has been hotel is a place of sanctuary, basically, where hell, there's no blood, there's no evil. It's a place where you can just chill. She's boring. <laughs> she tries to work through her daddy issues by fixing you. Here we offer <laughs> her daddy issues. Desperate attempt at salvation starts here. So, what do you think? I think you are awful at advertising. Nobody's gonna want to come to a place that a powerful overlord like you thinks is a waste of time. Filming a commercial. What are you? You're a porn star. A famous porn star. Famous porn star, that makes it all the better. You just know this thing as an OnlyFans. If you film me going at it with Mr. Fancy Talk Creepy, you get a lot of virgin teenager boys jacking over you. <laughs> Why can't he just make people stay here? I can't. Where do you? I don't understand what I'm looking at. The character design is so unique. I can't tell if they're animals or just freaks. <laughs> We're in hell, toots. Because nobody has made it out before doesn't mean it's not possible. Is that why they've made the rehabilitation hotel? So that they can repent for their sins and maybe get a chance on going to heaven? What could they want this soon after- I can do this. Somehow I know it. This is a musical. Not this once in a lifetime change. It's just a meeting. I did not think a series about hell would have music in it. Every street's so revealing, it's hard not to stare. Not doing well. Another shit day. <laughs> this is so fun. It'll be a happy day in hell. B switch. Oh, we're going full on theater kid mode. Touch my parts. Uh, no, thank you. I'm just gonna fulfill my destiny. <laughs> There's nothing that screams happiness than death. <laughs> this is my kind of series. My dad asked me if I could meet you. Yeah, I know. Okay. Is that an angel? If I'm going to heaven and I see that, I'm going to be scared to enter heaven. <laughs> about some lunch? You'll love it. <laughs> I got you again, bitch! <laughs> what a bitch! I've been a bad boy and I need a- Are they making a- Well, we could improv this sh I'm sorry, how are you a porn star? And you have no ass. Know who I am? I'm fucking Adam. I'm the original dick. There's no way that's Adam. That means you. Uh oh, that explains so much. <laughs> Leader of the angels, and you are a big thinker, a revolutionary. I mean, your words, babe. This Adam's a douchebag. Action. You're doing great, Vagina. That's not her name, right? Her name ain't Vagina. That can't be her legal name. Seems like you're having a bit of trouble there. Mm -hmm. This face was made for radio. Yeah, he deserves to be in hell. This guy ain't getting rehabilitated. He's long gone. I do this for you, or Charlie can come back to absolutely nothing. Your choice. This animation is still so aesthetically pleasing. And I'm so happy this is happening in an adult cartoon. It shows his actual love and care being put into this, which is something you really get nowadays. Problem of overpopulation in hell. We got that covered. How many demons did you kill this year? Got a good 275 this year. Imagine flexing how many people you killed to the person you also could have killed. <laughs> Those are my people. You know that, right? That must suck for you. 
<laughs> no, this guy deserves to be in hell. I know you guys fly down just to kill once a year, and it must be annoying to slip all the way here. Black and white, there's no use in trying to fight it. They're burning for their lives until we kill them again. They're going to feel musical in this, and I feel sinful already at the fact that I prefer the devil people over these quote unquote angels. These suck. Extermination is entertainment. This actually just screams WWE walkout. Entertainment. <laughs> do I do what I want? <laughs> How did it go? Did they listen? They sure did. Do you still want to go there after that? Just received word from the heaven embassy that the next extermination is happening sooner than ever before. You're like, you know what? I'm sick of your shit. You all know I'm actually gonna die. We found the body, sir. They've never managed to kill one of us before. They killed an angel. Oh, that's why they're putting the extermination closer. You're not supposed to do that. You're supposed to die like a little bitch. Yes, again. <laughs> what? I don't know what I just watched. I'm one episode in and I am dumbfounded. I feel like this is a show where you either will love it or hate it, especially with its dark storytelling so far and a lot of inappropriate discussions about serious topics. Extermination is coming in six months instead of a year. So you've got six months to try to stop the angels from excommunicating all of you. Sinners are desperate. Perfect time to recruit more sinners for the hotel! Yeah, but what's the point if he doesn't care about it? He's just gonna burn the hotel to the ground. I am the great serpent villain extraordinaire! Yeah, if you have to introduce yourself that you're a villain, you ain't intimidated at all, you're gonna die. I think I'd have heard of you. I attacked you literally last week. You must have been really bad at this. That's what I'm saying! Yeah, I fucked your sister, so what? <laughs> now that's good television! I'm convinced this is a fever dream. <laughs> There's no way this show is real. Oh, little boy toy is wrecking my department. Yeah, but you're English. No one cares about you. What are your thoughts on the new extermination deadline? We at Vox Tech Enterprise. Mr. Fox Drip slaps hard though. I can see you're busy. Tell me, where's our hot headed friend now? Up in his tower. What is happening right now? I'll leave what that piece of shit did. The ungrateful whore! <laughs> Which whore? There's so many of them. Angel dust. Who the hell else would I be talking about? Angel dust walked on you. You're like, I ought. I found a batter, bitch. See ya. <laughs> She's got this hotel, and which of these makes me look sexier? You're not going over there. Oh, he's gonna go to the Hasbin Hotel to kill Angel. Oh, is this guy the villain? Really wanted to shoot someone. Well, let me call up the lowest earners this month. <laughs> you just call up James Corden because of his irrelevancy. <laughs> Angel isn't the only one spending time at this ratty hotel. The radio demon is there. <laughs> Letting your guard down. Ah, ah. Nah, this guy sucks. Ah. Oh, no, he deserves to die. What is that? What you doing, lady? Look at how he flirts with that guy, and he's not even paying. <laughs> and he's not even paying for prostitution. That makes it so much better. <laughs> that is back. Yeah, I thought he was gone for good too. It's been seven years. Ah, uh, we getting villain song. To the show. Top of the hour, and we're discussing a certain has been who has been spotted cavorting. Unremarkable loser back from fucking off. <laughs> but he should have stayed away while he hid in radio. Like, what happened to them? Why did they hate each other so much? It's hated voice. Instead of a cloud chasing mediocre video podcast, it looks in. Oh. It's because he's TV and he's radio. They've been battling out for decades. That is so smart. Looking at the future, he's the shit that comes before that. I mean, that's just facts. So who actually listens to radio anymore? If you listen to radio, you're definitely born before 1960s. <laughs> Gonna make you wish that I'd stayed gone. You really should brush his teeth though. Oh, this will be fun. <laughs> Someone on the inside isn't such a bad idea. Someone pathetic. I think I have just the one. This show is so wild. Who are you? <laughs> How'd it go? <sighs> Not a single new recruit. Well, your commercial sucked in. Why, hello, 
my dear. And that's why you never got a woman. <laughs> Hello again. I didn't come looking for a fight. I, uh... Not this loser again. This place is about second chances, and who deserves one more than this? Yeah, but it's not even been a day. They literally tried to kill him a couple hours ago. You can't just switch mentality like that. Oh, we're excited to have our first real guest. Uh, what the hell am I then? <laughs> You're a third wheel. Bad boy is back. <gasps> Never leave me again. Nah, you can tell she's into some kinky stuff, man. The first step to becoming a better person is to admit when you are wrong. <gasps> Why don't you give it a try? Go fuck yourself. Everyone, follow me. My name is Charlie. I like to sing. My name is Welchie, and I am Itchy, and I don't like hay fever. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! Where's an innocent kid I can sell crack to? Who wrote this? It's great, right? What is happening? Why are they having a play in the rehabilitation center? Instead of coming out rehabilitated, they come up with a bachelor's degree in acting. <laughs> Not have sexual intercourse before marriage! Yay! Yeah! <laughs> Yay to purity! I'm so proud of you, Sir Prentice. That was amazing. Thank, Thank you. You, Thank you. you like me. I can't tell if he's sad because the snake got praised for his performance instead of him. Or if he's sad that the only way to be redeemed is to not have sex before a marriage. That is his worst nightmare. If you don't come home, you will be fucking greasy truckers for the next year. Hey, I'm gonna see. <laughs> Valentino's so bipolar. <laughs> There was something shitty about you. I don't know what you're talking. Why are you talking posh and proper? That will make you a good guy. She's a traitor. Never betray you. My best friend. You are my best friends. We met earlier on today. <laughs> Wait, you were caught? It hasn't even been a day. I told you he sucked. Why are you hiring a loser? If they don't kill you, do it yourself. Make it quick, I guess. It starts with sorry. <laughs> nah, it's the sweet sorry. Oh, nah, nah, nah. Fuck off. Who could forgive a dirtbag like me? Oh, God. Oh, no, no, no. Him singing just ruined my whole mood. I was maybe on the path of that he should love. Nah, he just had to open his mouth. Now he deserves to die again. <laughs> Say one sincere sorry. I'm so sorry. Dramatic. Ugh. Sorry. I hated that song. <laughs> so did I, little girl. Let there be death. What? You'll have to try harder than that next time, old pal. <laughs> Let's go to episode three. <laughs> I am so excited that Sir Pengis is staying at the hotel. Is that the snake? I am so bad with names. The only names I know so far is Charlie Vagina and Mr. Vox. Everyone is being too nice. Obviously, it must be a lie. I can sense they are- I actually hate this character. This guy is a waste of snake sperm. <laughs> well, I feel left out now. Do you ever made his pixels? That's to you. Do you want to stay here and redeem yourself? Yeah. Then no more eggs. All right. Yeah, cook them. I'm in the middle of breakfast. Pentius' eggs are all over the place and I need you to get rid of them. As he's casually eating Bambi. <laughs> we are starting with trust falls. Each of you are going to share something vulnerable with the group about yourself and then fall backwards. Yes, ma'am. I love to suck. I swear to fuck if you say dick. Pickles, <laughs> you sicko. <laughs> Aha, <laughs> you played your ass. <laughs> don't want to live without my minions. Nobody catch me. <laughs> Damn it. You don't want to live without your minions. Please kill your minions then. <laughs> Follow in silence if you value your shell. Greetings, Vestia. <laughs> <laughs> princess and her recent flight of fancy. Tell me, how does thou fall in such folly? I'm gonna be honest, this guy looks so intimidating. I can play a blank term what they're talking about. <laughs> I just hope they kill the eggs. Together you own millions of souls. Souls at risk with the new extermination schedule. Look how happy they are. Everyone's always so happy if they're not in the Hasbin Hotel. The Hasbin Hotel is not the place to be. Everyone's so depressed in there. This year's extermination was brutal. Brutal, oh, she's Latino. Discussion. <laughs> oh, tasty. 
What is it? Is that an angel? Can take the fight to them. Thou art far more foolish than I be thought. <laughs> Why is thee talking like Shakespeare? Does thee always have to talk thy this? <laughs> Rush to war without knowing might and they purge all of hell for getting an uprising. Is that even English? <laughs> you know, to make a real power grab. You oh. better show some respect. Maybe you missed it, but I'm that hashtag bitch and I will do. You actually just hashtag yourself. I was feeling the songs, but the last two songs now, someone's had to ruin it. You've got the snake guy and now you've got this English bitch. When our overlords too scared to fight, you're long past trending. <laughs> Cause when I brought out the angel's head, couldn't help but observe. That slaps though. You have a disclosure. This meeting's over. Mwah. I, I don't hate this. I'm ready to punish some bad boys. Uh, never mind, I, I'm a... <laughs> <laughs> this guy was loving the actual purity of a massage and she just has to make it sexual. <laughs> Nothing stronger than the trust between comrades in arms. Buckle up, because today you boys become men. Whoa. I can't fight without my minions. Are gonna survive together. <laughs> How many times will you have to watch your people be killed before we make headway? I'm supposed to make your dreams a reality. Your dreams a reality? Why is she just being a side bitch to Charlie? What about Vagina? What does she want? That sentence just sounds mad. I, I, that has to be another name. I, I'm going to start calling her Vagi. I love Vagi. Camilla, what troubles thou? Losing thy composure is unlike thee. Ah, uh, they like a love interest. Be fair, they would be a badass couple. Ways on your soul, old friend. Another music, another song. To be fair, I ain't complaining. They're absolute bops. This is so good. This is the most Disney song outside of Disney I've ever heard. It felt so good to be understood. I love Vagina. I, God damn it. Oh, you just need a hog woman. And my life being your partner. She's my favourite character, okay? I hope whatever her aspirations are, she finds them. That shot. Oh, this is so good. Whatever it takes. Oh. oh, the parallels. Oh, this is so awesome. Both showing that they just want to do the right thing for the people they love. So, what did you hear? You're the one who killed the angel. You whatever it takes. Wait, she killed the angel? Does she have regret for killing the angel? What? What your exercise did for that. You guys started beating the shit out of you. That was particularly unpleasant. Ah, yes. I loved when I got beaten the hell up. <laughs> it was awesome. Thank you for pulling me out of there. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Wait, they're actually learning manners. Is this has been hotel actually working? How was your day with Alistair, my minion? Knife lady killed an angel. Was not supposed to talk about it. <laughs> Good night, Eggy. Finally awake. Angel dust. Oh, did the angel dust finally get captured by V? Hilarious, you think I tell you anything? Fine! Wait, no, who is this? Oh, I mean, they deceived me. Their acting, their acting is pretty good, man. They are quite good at their job. I know everything about you and these motherfuckers at this point. I see right through you and all this bullshit and how fake you are. I mean, he is an actor. It's my job. Unless you can fix my boss, there's nothing you can do. You're the princess of hell. So? Don't really use the power that comes with that. Yes. The power to make all your subjects a slave and make them all do your bidding. Do you really expect me to memorize this whole script? Just improv it. Oh, so many burglars. Uh, uh, we, ah, uh, I'm here to get you some time off for the hotel. Now where's your boss? Oh, uh, no, 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 no. You are going nowhere near there. Oh, it's just like an innuendo talking about something not directly, but it's showing how disgusting and bad some of the people in the porn industry are. Ah, your majesty. Welcome to my humble sex dungeon. Well, at least it's humble. <laughs> what I do for such a... Ah. You are 
are disgusting. Eight to nine p.m. Cut! What the? Me. Were we too loud? It doesn't bother me one bit. Oh, look at his face. He's so gonna kill him. Those that are more <laughs> Oh, he's a butterfly? Right, so it seems like all these characters are based on insects, which is disgusting because I hate insects. If you can hold an insect in the palm of your hand, you you are just, you are built different. <laughs> Val, I didn't know that you- <laughs> Lucifer's little bitch fight your battles for you? Oh my God, oh my God. <laughs> You think she can get you out of work? No! Ah, uh, uh, no, this is actually really disturbing. I own you, or have you forgot? Oh my god, a binding contract. You know how messed up this actually is? It's the fact that this isn't even fiction. This actually happens in real society, which is so disturbing and disgusting. You're lucky you make me money! Now, you're gonna go get rid of her, and then you're filming all night! I am scared. I am- I'm literally emotionally and physically scared. The voice acting is incredible, whoever this is. And I thought this was gonna be a children's animation show. <laughs> Makes you think you can treat him like that! Charlie! Just stop! <laughs> Charlie, leave! This is so sad and wild. And now the victim that is literally getting abused is made out to look like he's the bad guy in front of Charlie. You actually want to help me? Get the f*** out of here. Right now. Oh my god, he's crying inside. Love does Charlie know he's actually trying to save you. Good boy. Action. I'm not a bubble of the cash. Are we getting a song with s or soul? What the hell? What am I watching? Cause I know you're poison. I shouldn't like a song when the character's literally getting abused in it. So I, I just don't know what to feel. Poison. I got so good at being untrue. This is filmed like it's part of a music video as well. I mean, he sings amazing at least. At least he has the power to sing. Poison, wish I had something to live for tomorrow. Rocky deserves a day off. Wow, I'm actually happy there's no one <laughs> That was so hard to watch. What the f was that song? I need a drink. And where should I look? In your bedroom, maybe? Under the cover? Maybe we can... Oh, uh, no, no, not with the hand. Stop with the hand movement, man. Pull me fake one more time, mother... <laughs> I dare you. Fake. <laughs> you prick. Angel, where are you going? Don't force him back. Just make sure he's safe. I pushed too hard earlier. Oh my god. And now it's all your fault. Ah, uh, this episode's too real. But this is actually the world we live in. I'm so perplexed. <laughs> so I said, you couldn't afford me in a million afterlives. My head's absolutely gone. Be a doll and bring me another one. <laughs> Oh my god, he's going to spike him. Nice try. Let's go. What the? Hey! Oh my god, that's his f***ing mental. What am I watching? You just let people drug you all the time? You think I asked for it? I didn't ask to be this way. I didn't ask for Charlie to save me. Oh, no, 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 no. Someone needs to help this guy, man. This guy is at his wit's end. His mental's completely gone. And rightly so. Everyone's controlling his life. This is my escape. Forget about it all. I, how much I hate. Oh my god. If I end up broken, I won't be his favorite toy anymore. Do you know how gone you have to be to basically lose yourself so you can finally try and be free? But when you're dealing in souls while also being a gambler, the stakes are pretty high. Did he, oh, did he sell his soul away? Even making deals yourself. So I know what it's like. Did he sell his soul to the radio guy? Wait, what? You're a loser, baby, a loser. <laughs> Another song about how crap my life is. <laughs> You're a power bottom at rock bottom, but you got company. <laughs> you're a loser. But at least you're a loser with company. <laughs> to the gruesome ways in which I'm damaged. We're both losers, baby, we're losers. Oh, why is this so cute? It's okay to be a there's something cute cool about them singing together and how low down the food chain they are. It's kind of humble. Oh my soul to save my power. Now I'm on that demon's leash. Loser, 
but just maybe if we eat shit together. Hey, hey, eat crap together? No, I'll, I, no, thank you. Just like there he is. <laughs> yeah, right? They really are losers. <laughs> I told you, I can handle myself. I just realized, see when you die in hell, what happens to you then? Like you're already in hell, where else do you go? You don't know me. Cause this guy ain't half bad. <laughs> and now they're best friends, yay. I'm so sorry. Charlie, F it's fine. I get it. Angel, you're talking to the doctor of Lucifer. Surely, just tell her. Surely she might have a way to get you out of this contract. How about that drink? You read my mind. I'm gonna go shower and I'll resume this because I, I feel, oh, I, I, yeah, I'll be back. <laughs> you good? Nope. I've been up all night trying to figure out why the hotel isn't working. We've done trust falls. Why is it not working? Because you're a loser. That's what the song about Erlu was for. You're all losers. <laughs> he let the extermination happen to begin with. <gasps> he could get me a meeting with heaven. You already tried that though. Adam, but he isn't in charge of all of heaven. We could go to the top. And meet what? God? What's the hold up? You got daddy issues. No. Presenting the magic testicle. There's no way that's Lucifer. Daughter, daughter calling. Oh. Hi, dad. Hey, how are you? Oh my God, actually it is Lucifer. That is the most anticlimactic thing I've ever seen. I thought he was going to be some badass looking character. He looks like he'd be the conductor in a circus. I need to speak to heaven. I need to go to the top. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. He does not have the facilities for that. <laughs> Come see what I'm trying to do. You'll see why it's a really good idea and heaven is bound to agree. Yes, come see my hotel where nothing happens and I have one recruit so far. <laughs> that, yes, that will really sell it. Inviting me over? Oh. Absolutely. <gasps> my daughter didn't disown me? It's showtime. Charlie. Hey, Dad. <laughs> Lucifer seems like such a nice guy and a nice dad. Yeah, he's just an absentee parent and he's probably not even a nice person. <laughs> just some of the renovations we had done. And you are? Alistair, pleasure to be meeting you. Well, I don't think anyone's ever disrespected Alistair like that. You are much shorter in real life. <laughs> hey, that's my short king right there. He represents. <laughs> She's my girlfriend. Oh my golly, you like girls. Yes, so do I. We have so much in common. He doesn't know how to take the fact that his daughter's a lesbian. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like you could use some help from the big boss of hell himself. What in the Barbie ass music is this? <laughs> uh, who's been here since day one? Who's been faithful as a nun? I have a bad feeling about Alistair. He has something up his sleeve. He's definitely using Charlie. You're like the child that I wish that I had. Uh, what? I care for you just- Oh, Lucifer's jealous because Alistair is like the father Charlie never had. Is Lucifer and Alistair gonna have a battle? I'll also be your blood. Sadly, there are times a birth parent is a dog. I mean, I know they're having a literal rap battle right now, but an actual physical battle. Your song, I started this. I'm singing it, I'll finish it. Are you attacking me? It's me. Yes, it's me. Who the hell are you? Mimsy. Seen her in her heyday. Hey, watch it, tall, dark, and creepy. What are you into? Tall, dark, and creepy? And you are just my type. <laughs> Charlie and I have a tour to continue. I'm sure Charlie can handle showing me around. Oh, nonsense! I just realized Lucifer is smaller than Charlie. Now, this might be the saddest thing yet. How you been, furball? Good. Until five minutes ago. This guy's such an introvert. And I love that because he's exactly how I feel 24 7. Oh, and Alistair, I like, what? What's his deal? Well, you probably heard the stories. Oh, we're getting Alistair backstory? Overlord started going missing. No one knew what happened to him until these strange radio. You don't know what happened to him? Wow, so Alistair just shows up. And all of a sudden, all the powerful overlords start going missing. Hmm, I wonder who it could be. Every time an overlord went missing, there'd be a new voice screaming in the broadcast. So they all died via voice command? <laughs> Stop with the looks. He hasn't done any of that in a while. That redemption is possible. This whole hotel will be full of demons. Like if you listen to any other podcast or radio station, Alistair would just come for you via voice. <laughs> You've been gone a while. And it's not like anybody knows why. You worry your 
fuzzy head about. <laughs> oh. Big talk for someone who's also on a leash. What did you say? <laughs> oh, this is just so toxic. Soul apart and broadcast your screams for every other disrespectful. Nah, nah, nah. This is some horror type esque media. I don't think I'll ever be the same after this. What do you think about using the hotel to help sinners? Ah. <sighs> It's shit. Heaven is not exactly as carefree as you might think. Have to try. Our people are awful. <laughs> and that's why I wanted to kill them all. Ah, jeez, what now? What's going on? Maybe be in trouble with some loan sharks. Ah, uh, is that why you crawled back to Alistair? Because you're in trouble. She's the worst. She's like one of the friends where they only need you for their own benefit. They actually don't care about you. I'll take care of this. Now, my dear, leave it to me. Oh, we're going to see Alistair go super sane. A radio demon. <laughs> <laughs> Charlie, sinners are violent psychopaths. Stop! He's defending this hotel. He's defending this hotel. No, he ain't, girl. He's doing this for his own pleasure. He don't give two shits about your hotel. You deliberately brought danger to this place just to have me clean up your mess. Oh, he can see right through you. You need to leave. Well, fine. Who needs ya? Who needs ya? You, Mimsy, you would be dead. That's the only reason you're even there, because you're about to die. Evan never listens. You don't know that. I do. Oh, he's so heartbroken. In the end, I won't lose it all again. Heaven really played this man, didn't he? You're the only thing worth fighting for. Wait, you actually care about her? Shelter and let all you more oh than my anything. God. Nah, man, the pipes on these vocalists are insane. Dad, when I was young, I didn't really know you at all. This is so good. Imagining it could be me. So. Ooh, who are you? It's the view I had of you. Ah, she's looking at tits. <laughs> More than anything. been dying to find out who you are I've been waiting Oh, this is so sweet In the end You are part of who I am oh, This is such an adorable father-daughter moment More than anything More than anything More than anything No, 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 stop, stop, stop These songs are phenomenal Okay, I can get you the meeting, but once you're in heaven you are alone. I can support your dreams, but I won't help you any further. I'm ready, because you'll be with me. In spirit, right? In heaven. Yay! She is not excited to go to heaven. There's a backstory here. Is she afraid of the angels? Or did she confront them before? No matter what you think of this series, there's no denying these songs are incredible. They're so good. It's illegal to think otherwise. I have a light jacket, flat jacket, and rain jacket. Wait. Does it rain in heaven? Does it rain in heaven? As you are above the clouds. <laughs> Last chance to convince heaven a soul can be redeemed. Wish I could come, but I have that thing. What thing? That thing where I have more in my back so than you know. Did she kill an angel? Is she an angel? I have so many theories. I don't know who one to go with. It seems like everyone has a backstory that's deeper than we originally think on the surface. Like even this little creep. What's with that wall? What up, boys? <laughs> Piss shit up like old times. Responsible night on the town. Charlie ruins everything. One of Angel's friends. Oh, he never brings anyone around. <laughs> Wonder why. <laughs> Make sure they have the best time tonight. The portal to heaven should be opening right about. <gasps> so is Cherry like the babysitter of them all while they're gone? They just introduce characters so quickly without any backstory. Like, why is she there? <laughs> I'm going out with Angel and I gotta drag your sorry asses along. Oh! Oh! You and me are... Snake Man has such a big crush on Cherry Bomb. And to be fair, I don't blame her. I mean, look at that. I don't know what it is, but I'm secretly attracted to her. <laughs> I'm not seeing you on my list. My dad got me this meeting, so maybe... Oh, try okay. Lucifer? Oh! Fuck! Oh, fuck! You're not supposed to be here. We're... we're here for a meeting. St. Peter. We can take it from here. St. Peter. I better see a St. Patrick's Day. <laughs> Welcome to heaven. Oh, where the virtuous reside 24 7. Oh. Nah, I actually hate the vibe of this. Welcome to heaven. Oh, check out our sick decor. Nah, this song's far too child friendly. Of course it is 
just temporary. I'm sorry you can't stay. Cause Cause every single day. But why is it temporary? I mean, the whole point of the show is that they get a second chance to go to heaven. Does that not exist? Am I seeing who I think I'm seeing? What is she doing here? No one but the exorcist can know about the exterminations, I know. So no one in here actually knows they're doing this. Keeping heaven safe was my only reason for allowing. I want you to do whatever you need to do to keep this problem from getting any worse. What? Kill everyone? That's the whole point of what the genocide every year is about. To make sure they all die. This woman deserves to be in hell. Charlie will be back soon. Not looking for the blonde, babe. I'm looking for you. Cause you left the band. You left the band. Recognize one of my top girls just cause you're at a uniform? You were on the front line. Wait. She was actually an angel. Was she supposed to be undercover in hell, playing as a demon when in fact she's an angel? And she actually liked it, so decided to stay. Run, now. <laughs> That's why she's blind. These angels suck. Someone as worthless as you landed Lilith's little hottie. Congrats on that. I and Charlie saved you. I wonder what your bitch would think if she found out you are actually one of us. Hmm. Something she would kill. Charlie has the least personality in this whole show. I bet you she'd find it hot. Gathered here today to determine whether or not a soul in hell can be redeemed into the heavenly realm. What do you think it takes to get into heaven? Uh. Act selfless, don't steal, stick it to the man. Are you? <laughs> Well, I bet Angel is doing all of those things right now. Then let's fucking see it, bruh. I need a drink <laughs> after today. You know, Val. Angel, enough with the Val talk. He already ruined your whole day. You mean life, girl? You want to fuck up all your progress? Be my guest. Thanks, Captain Buzzkill. Come on, Angie, let's get fucked up. Nah, he's not gonna do it. He's way past that now. He wants to be a new man. Let's see where the night takes us, huh? I, I guess. Nah, nah, don't, don't. Nah. This is a great message not to give into peer pressure. Yeah, let's do it. I love how every episode has a different message. This one is to not give into peer pressure. Star chose a night of debauchery. Angel will make good decisions. Come on, we have to keep watching. Let's give him a chance. <laughs> no, he won't. <laughs> Angie, you're supposed to be relaxing, not playing nanny. Nah, my, she's so hot. I'm so down for Cherry Bomb. Why are you being such a mess? <laughs> See, whatever Nifty's backstory is, I don't care. I, she sucks. Maybe you'd want to uh, do a sex with me. <laughs> At least you're giving consent. <laughs> Valentino. Yeah, I'm here all the time. They know me. Oh, no. Oh, no, not this absolute wet wipe. Yeah. Drink, drink or I'll fucking kill you. <laughs> oh, here we are. Nef this little nifty bitch is going to ruin everything, isn't she? Who's this chiquita? You're bringing me fresh meat. He needs to be put in prison. Fuck off. I may have to put up with your bullshit, but you ain't fuck with any of my friends. Oh, you will. So once again, fuck off. Oh. <laughs> oh, Andrew just got brought back down to earth. Show some courage. Nah, you're still a bitch in my book. <laughs> it was worth it. Way to go, kid. Angie, I'm glad this hotel shit is working for you, but you know me. I love to crash some waves, surf some boards. I'm Australian. Shark in the water and all that. Is Cherry still here? <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> did everything on your checklist. But th then why isn't he here then? Because he's contracted to an absolute freak. None of you know what gets someone into heaven. We know when a soul arrives. Wait, they know when a soul arrives, but they don't know why they're there. They're just there by chance. They don't actually know the categories and how to be in heaven. We saw the light, Sarah. Prove a person deserves a second chance. I don't even know who this is. Even the C characters can sing so well. Why is everyone so talented in this series? Keep a cool head. No, don't you care, Sarah? Yes, Sarah. What are we even talking about? He blew his shot like the cocks in his mouth. <laughs> oh, wow. I can't lie, that bar was kind of cold, though. <laughs> I can't wait to come down and exterminate you. Wait, shit. I love how he's just grasped himself in that he goes down there and kills everyone. Go down there and kill those poor You dogs. didn't know. What? Yes, the cat's out of the bag. What's the big deal? <laughs> oh, what's the big deal? I go and kill innocent children. They wanted to save you. The anguish it takes to do what was required. Ah, oh, 
job, but she has the fire in her eyes. This is so good. If hell is forever, then heaven must be alive. Emily. If angels can do whatever. Yeah, this is what you call girl boss. Trust in angels. By her? She should know. Oh, they're gonna tell her. Why hide the fact that you're an angel just like us? <laughs> oh, I love how it always been revealed in this one music video. This whole series worth of information just just got answered in two minutes. <laughs> Were you actually distraught? I thought you would have been turned on by that. I can't lie. This court finds that there is no evidence souls in hell can be redeemed. Oh fuck yes! <laughs> this guy's actually hilarious, man. Demon or not, there is no reason to be doing this. A worry about the fates of demons when we have our own souls to protect. She's so self-centered. Where are your wings? Did you ever think maybe she's sensitive about her lack of wings? Just like her lack of tits. <laughs> and she's like, wait, where are they? <laughs> Sad days when every character, even the males, have bigger tits than you. <laughs> but Charlie's trying her best. And where is Miss Fearless Leader anyway? I In bet our she's room. crying her eyes out. In our room. Alone. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> she is crying her eyes out. <laughs> what a weak ass bitch. They came here to be saved, and all I gave them was more pain. Overlord in hell. <laughs> I love Alistair. Alistair's one of the best characters in this show. Adam has an invincible exorcist army pointed right at my doorstep, and there's nothing I can do about any of it. Oh, no, that smell. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. The angels are not quite as indestructible as they seem. How? I'll do anything. Let's make a deal. Oh. So I love how manipulative Alistair is. One favor at a time of my choosing. Turn, I tell you what I know. Do we have a deal? Deal. Uh, oh, shit. It's about to break loose. What did you do? Let her go. Baggy, stop. I love Alistair because you never know what game he's playing. You don't know if he's on Charlie's side. I think he is, but what is his true motives? Carmilla Carmine? She killed an exorcist in the last extermination. She knows how they can be harmed. I know that was possible. How did you not know? You're an angel and you've lost an eye. That knife lady, Camaro Carfight, killed one. Wait, you knew about this? The eggs are the integral part to this whole scheme. They say insane sh all the time. How was I supposed to do this? <laughs> <laughs> nah, I've never seen a 180 character arc turn likes or pinches. His character is hilarious, bro. <laughs> Who hasn't thought about eating their first husband? I certainly would have if he didn't taste so bad. Cannibals. Is that supposed to be hot? Alistair, she's much too young for you. Oh, I'm just kidding. I know you're an ace in the hole. Wait, Alistair's asexual? His wrist is off the charts, though. Probably watching your figure. How about some nice pinky fingers instead? She's like, no, thank you. I'd like some ass, though. The extermination is coming early. Your cannibals help, at least, to fend off the attack. Your cannibals help. Wait, are they going to eat the angels? Carmine, we need to speak. Talk about it inside or I can yell about it out here. Nah, 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 nah. She actually just queen slayed that. Forget chair bomb. She needs lessons from Vaggy. You have two minutes to convince me not to silence you for good. <laughs> the Latino intro. We know an angel fell at your hands and we need to know how. No. <laughs> I will not invite destruction into my house on my people. Yeah, sure. She's doing it to protect her daughters, but without their help, aren't they just going to kill everybody regardless? Out of time. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, are we getting a Latino song? Oh, senorita. Get this group into line. You gotta win them over. How do I? With sparkle, razzmatazz. A hunger for body parts. <laughs> You'll need to convince all of them. And there's one in particular. Susan. Susan. Imagine being called Susan. A princess, Charlie. Bring Rosie back. Susan. 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 Do you know what's funny? I'm not even surprised that's what Susan looks like. She looks such like a Susan. Get off this hotel with my heart. You yeah, blue well, blood, bitch. And the, wait, let me. I love how Carter's whole persona this series is to sell the husband hotel, and she's failed every single time. Ministry. <laughs> Fuck you, mediocre. Uh, Fuck you, you old. <laughs> oh my God, she swore. <laughs> Oh, you're getting your ass beat. Oh. It's like she's doing the salsa with Vaggy. Listen to the Latino Mexican music. It's like they're teasing us this whole time. Just play the goddamn song. You know I'm an exorcist? Ow. You have a giant X over your eye and wield an angelic spear. Wait, and no one noticed that before. Strike the here and here. 
With what? Realize you're holding the answer? Yeah, use your own weapons against you. My daughters and I were cornered in that last extermination. She's a badass. Oh! I see you're driven by your detest- Yes! Come on! I think it's illegal for a song to be bad in the Hasbun Hotel. I've, I don't think there's been a single miss. Fight with all you can give. See, I don't know if they're fighting anymore. I think they're just dance battling. Vaggy has slayed this whole episode so far. This is the episode of Vaggy. My girlfriend is an exorcist angel, and she never told me. Oh, boo hoo, cry me off. River. The whole point of the Hasbun Hotel is for second chances. You f hypocrite. Isn't that silly hotel of yours all about redemption? Thank you. Oh, this woman has brain cells. Now she's off learning how to protect everything we've worked for. And you're here whining like a little bitch. You normally explain your hotel by singing. Ever wanted something that? How'd you get through to cannibals? By song. <laughs> now I need to be ready for this. You know they could just add their cousin before this. Wouldn't it be super to see more of hell? Wait, I am not feeling this song. They're on the attack. When they move to strike, we will fight fighting back. Sure, it's not bad, but it ain't going on the playlist. This actually might be a miss. Keep singing, we're super duper grateful to have you folks aboard. And I just said I thought that'd be impossible. When Adam brings the battle here, I must appear like I'm ready for this. I mean, you bear it's about time. She's actually been useless. For any chance Charlie has on redeeming herself for me, she has to kick Adam's ass. I really hope that I'm ready for this. Yeah, that's the weakest song so far. Got you a souvenir from Cannibal Town. <gasps> oh, for me? They just have sex in the street now. <laughs> Loco decided to show up. We thought we were fighting by ourselves. They three are the goats of the show. Looks like we have a lot of work to do. Let's go in the last episode. Woo! Teamwork makes the dream work. They're gonna fight? Oh my god. Mr. Vox. I'm surprised how irrelevant he's been this series. I thought him and Valentina were going to be the main antagonist. Fear not, damsel. I shall have the staff ready for victorious combat. <laughs> <laughs> I love how confident Sir Penchis is when he's probably the weakest character here, but I don't even care anymore. He's so funny. I actually love him. If you see an angel, stab it. <laughs> Imagine after all he's been through, he dies by fucking nifty. <laughs> I'd be so disappointed in myself. <laughs> They're gonna f die. <laughs> They're Honestly, at the start, I was kind of skeptical of the show and their representations of their ideologies and, and certain topics. But not only is the music god tier, it's so funny. Getting to know you has been the biggest honor of my life. Whatever redemption really means. What is this heel speech? Is this foreshadowing? Is she gonna die? Does and Alistair live die? Tonight, I feel like that would be the biggest you twist. Want. Live tonight, however you want, because we're all gonna. Woo! Let's give up for dying, baby! Last day of afterlife. You're not off snorting a lion off some hunk's ass. You f***ed one cannibal pool boy, you f***ed them all. That is the most sliced thing he's ever said. Miss Bomb Cherry. Oh, please. I want oh, my God. I... Yes. This king deserves it. I'd love to wish you good luck in the battle, Ed. Have you actually shot up? Please don't die tomorrow. Okay, bye. Oh, no, no, no. No, this king deserves cherry bomb. You know, I hear he's got two dicks. Exactly, and what's better than one? Two! And oh, it's a reprise of. More than anything. More than anything. Oh, this is so wholesome. I guarantee you the original More Than Anything is going to be the top of my repeat on Spotify. Finally! They've cast. Woo! Gay people! You all remember Vaggie? Oh, Is Vaggie the one that dies? Ladies, let's fuck shit up. Attack! I feel like Adam could be the head singer of Metallic Band. Let the slaughter begin. Oh, this is mental. <laughs> Adam's like, damn it, am I actually that weak? <laughs> Mr. Shield is working! Trying to focus, sweetie. Uh, we might actually 
actually have a chance. Okay, that's crazy optimism while still in the fight. You've just jinxed it now, you idiot. Adam's like the final boss. Oh, I am so horny for this. We're going to get an Adam Alistair showdown. I'm about to end your life. <laughs> Yay! Tougher than you. <laughs> you lack discipline, control. Alistair and isn't even trying. He's actually playing with his food. You're this is so sick. Dead. What just happened? Fuck. <laughs> I think Alistair could be defeated. What is this sorcery? Sorry! 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 Now's not the time! Sorry, I know you're trying to kill me, but oh, sorry! How, how is this Lucifer's daughter? Oh, are you gonna make him scrambled? Angel doesn't die, right? Bro, well, my anxiety is through the roof. Aren't gonna last long unless we do something about him! Of course! What? <laughs> yes! Oh, oh my god, my king! I love you! Remember me! Remember me? He's not gonna die, right? You can't just kill off a character who became irrelevant and became the most giga chad king on the whole show. Target in range! Fire! Alistair saves him, right? Did he just- Shut up! Did he just yeah, die? Be... But he just got the bitch, man! He was about to top it! You just killed off the funniest character, the biggest Chad, and you prevented him from tapping it. Shame on you. You did good, no, buddy. No. He's actually dead. So Shut up. I thought they were playing with me. Finally! Revenge his ass! Charlie, do something, you irrelevant prick! Traitor came to die. If I get just die too. Try it, bitch. <laughs> it's like they're boxing in the Wii Sports. Risking your immortal life for sinners? Lucifer's brat. Lucifer's brat, do something. Serpentius didn't die for nothing. You should have stayed in your place, girly. <laughs> Finally. Fi <sighs> <laughs> There's so much action and death in this episode. This is crazy. Do it then. Oh, rip off the eye. Live knowing that you only do because I like you. That's mad. She's she's a psychopath. Oh, so I feel like it would have been hard if she took her eye as well. That would have been so that would have been such a what comes around or goes around moment. <laughs> Where have you been? You couldn't have did that before Sir Pencha sacrificed himself. Lucifer's Jeremy Jordan. I'm sorry I even doubted you. I will never disrespect Lucifer again. It's voiced by Jeremy Jordan. You mess with my daughter and now I am going to fuck you. <laughs> Andrew's like, can I join? <laughs> You're the most hated being in all of creation. Well, your first wife didn't seem to hate what I had to offer. <laughs> I love how Lucifer isn't even trying. <laughs> they're, they're making this so intense. The music Lucifer toying with Adam. I feel like they're just playing with my heart right now. You oh, face reveal. Adam is low key hot. God damn. Losers. You got something sticking out of here. Wait. <laughs> You mean to tell me this little psychopath defeated the one and only Adam? Not Lucifer, not Charlie, not Alistair, this little psychopath. Does that mean Nifty can defeat Lucifer? Is she now the most powerful in hell? And go home! Please. You said please. Good evening, I'm Katie Killjoy. And I'm- Breaking news, this little psychopath Nifty saved hell. Adam, leader of the Angelic Legion's first man in Can someone kill Valentino? This is the one we're all waiting for. Yo, are you, are you actually gonna make me cry? This bloodshed could have been avoided. I am about to lose it. The show, it must go on. We can do this. Look how happy they are already. They did not care about Serpentius. Time for crying. We got a lot of work to do. And we gotta try and 
See, they're building back up the has been hotel. I expect a full on memorial for Serpentius. Well, the rest of hell's pissing. Alistair's missing. Fled with his tail between his legs. Why is he still alive? Hungry for freedom. Where are you? Like never before. The constraints of my team. Alistair is losing his mind if he didn't already. <laughs> But why do I just feel sad? Serpentius <gasps> ah! 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 is the first sinner in hell to be redeemed for heaven. Oh, hello. <laughs> My God! You're going down there and oh, stopping that you? bitch. You understand me, Lilith? Oh, Lilith, that's Charlie's mom. Lilith, I like- No! No, Lilith, I need more of Lilith. What a very nice necklace she has. Umbrellas, what a surprising show. I am emotionally, mentally, physically wrecked. <laughs> the show has destroyed me. I don't- I- 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 I don't- Yeah, wow, well, I just had a malfunction. <laughs> I don't know how to feel right now. All I know is, God bless Serpentius. Let me know what other TV shows you want me to binge or watch, and yeah, I'm away to cleanse myself. Bye-bye.